You have two questions. You said that the president was talking about wearing a mask improperly last night, touching it, referring to what Dr. Fauci has said. But he said, quote, there are people that don't think masks are good. That's clearly not what the CDC director thinks, since he said today that masks are important, powerful public health tool we have. They could be even more protective against COVID than a vaccine. So have any medical experts told the president that masks aren't good, or is he only citing non-medical experts like he did last night? He's referring to the fact that when used appropriately, um, they can have unintended consequences, much like what Dr. Fauci said. Um, it's not providing the perfect protection that people think that it is, and oftentimes there are unintended consequences. So the president agrees with Dr. Fauci that uh, mask wearing is good. It's recommended. The president's continually recommended it from this podium, but he was just pointing out some of the unintended consequences if not used appropriately. He didn't say that. He just said there are people no, who think masks are Do you have his whole exchange? Would you like to read it out? There, I mean, I watched it last night. There was a bit of talk about don't think masks are good. He didn't say improperly or anything Caitlin, like that. He went on in the very... Unfortunately, a bunch of you are very keen on doing selective editing of the president's quotes and not referring to the second half. Directly under that statement, he talked about a waiter touching the mask, then touching a plate, and that being an unintended effect of wearing a mask. That is an example of a mask not being yeah, used appropriately. Waiters don't think masks are good. But he, and he, de he, described, he described the exact scenario in which a mask could have an unintended consequence if not used appropriately. And we can send you the clip. We'll put it up on Twitter no, for you. It's okay. Um, I just wanted to see if there's any medical experts who have said that. Um, on and they the have, and I just read Dr. Fauci's quote, so go ahead. Yes, I've read Dr. Fauci's quote. Um, on the health care plan, the chief of staff said today that there is going to be one unveiled before the election, the one that the president has been promising for over a year now, long before then. But today on Capitol Hill, the three top medical experts in this administration said they have no idea of any kind of plan that's being formulated. So who is it that is working on the health care plan that's going to be introduced before the election? So here at the White House, um, we have a wide array of people working on it. Um, there have been elements of it that have already come out, like the telemedicine plan, uh, the drug importation EO, the most favored nations were elements of what is an overarching plan. Um, there's more that will be forthcoming. Um, and in aggregate, um, it, it's going to be a very comprehensive um, strategy, one where we're saving health care while Democrats are trying to take health care away, um, where we're making health care better and cheaper, guaranteeing protections for people with pre-existing conditions, stopping surprise, medical billing, in increasing transparency, uh, defending the right to keep your doctor and your plan, fighting lobbyists and special interests, and making healthier um, and fi making finding cures um, to diseases. And those are the principles um, that will animate multiple stakeholders here at the White House um, who work on policy. So our Domestic Policy Council and others are working on a health care plan. Not the CDC yes. director, not Bob yes. Padlock, not Admiral Jouar. None of them have any idea about the health care plan. I'm plans. not going to give you a readout of what our health care plan looks like and who's I'm working on it. If you want to know, if you want to know, come work here at the White House. Yes. So I just wanted to know who's working on it. Yes. Stakeholders here in the White House. And as I told you, our Domestic Policy Council and others in the White House are working on a health care plan, the president's vision for the next five years.